the Ducast Neurostimulator V, a new option for treatment of PAD and chronic pain. One box contains four packages of stimulators. One device is for a therapy of 14 days. We recommend a change to the other ear after seven days. Therefore, every package contains two needles, two alcohol swabs, two clip holders, and several fixation plasters, and a magnet pin for intensity regulation. Via an efferent nerve net, located in the fossa triangularis that leads over C2 and C3 to the nucleus tractus solitari in the brainstem, the vegetative nerve system should be modulated and affected positively. You can't miss the nerve structure in the marked area. With the attached alcohol swab, you have to clean the punction area as well as the areas where the cable will be fixed. The sterile packaged special needle should be located in the recommended, preferably flat, area in the fossa triangularis. The butterfly plaster on the needle is thought for the first fixation. Two of the fixation plasters have to be fixed cross over the needle for a stable fixation. The cable is laid to the backside of the ear and fixed with a the plaster there. Please pay attention on a not too strong fixation over the edge of the ear to avoid a pressure incision. As soon as the device is connected with the electrode, it is activated and starts to stimulate with 1 Hz. Within the stimulation phase of 40 minutes, the red LED blinks every 10 seconds. And the following pause of 20 minutes it does not. The alternation of stimulation and pause is programmed automatically for 14 days. With every disconnection of the cable from the device, the stimulation is interrupted. The device will be put in the holder and fixed in a suitable area at the shoulder. The cable tray should not limit the patient's comfort. The strength of the electric current is set slightly. The patient should not feel it too strong. Many of the patients cannot feel the pulses after a while. This is okay. Important, too strong density is counterproductive and could hurt during the therapy. We recommend an additional placement of a plaster at the begin of the cable. The current intensity increases by swiping the magnet pin from the blue point along the slot and back. After that, the pin is to lift and a double flash follows. Repeat the procedure for every next step. When the maximum is reached, the LED blinks four times. The current intensity decreases by tipping the blue point with the magnet pin. After that, the pin is to lift and the LED flashes once. For the optimal current intensity, the patient's subjective perception is used. If this therapy works efficient, you can see it at least after three to four weeks of treatment.